If you guys want any cheap MSP, PSN codes or cheap game codes, make sure you go over to G2A.com and use discount code B87 to get 3% off your total order. Hi guys and welcome to another episode of Fatal, the series where we take Man of the Match Luis Suarez all the way up to a gold team hopefully and then compete against the other YouTubers in this group. If you don't know which YouTubers are involved in this group guys, make sure you check down in the description down below and there's seven other YouTubers and this is a world tour as well so there's seven other tournaments going on. Currently I think four of them are still yet to start but that's what's going to be happening this weekend. So in the last episode guys I give you a choice of who to put into a team, you chose your man. Pedro and Inform Rakitic. So both of them entered the field of play now and will be playing. If you don't know the rules, make sure you check back on episode 1 where all is explained in there but it's basically, if Suarez scores, we get 30k. If anyone else scores, it's 20k. You concede a goal, it's minus 20k. That's what we're going to be doing today and uh, hopefully we can try and get a decent looking team. Now La Liga isn't my favourite but obviously, man, the match Suarez is there, so we're going to have to have some of the Liga players in there. So, guys, let's go into game number one and see how we do in that. So game number one, online single match number one as well against the full chemistry team. And we come against Royce, Obama Yang, and also Walcott. A nice attacking trio of players. Sweaty as fuck, yes, but we're aiming to get goals and that is the aim of the game. So, the rain as well, the unfortunate thing of uh, being put away. And uh, obviously, if you play at home, I have the king fire, so we have no rain. He takes the lead within minutes and puts us down minus 20,000 coins. Very, very frustrating. But, I know I've got Luis Suarez in there. I know he can do some damage. And with Manier as well, the upgraded Manier seems to be uh, seems to be ripping stuff up, actually. He's quite fast. Um, I do notice is quite weak as well but he does pass it back to Suarez and gets us on a plus 30k which takes us to 10k in profit this game alone uh, then Pedro linking up with Suarez again Suarez seeing Munir breaking on through and at this point we are just going for the win because we need points so plus 20 for Munir there and uh, it's plain sailing this game was fun now in the first episode guys and also I'm going to clear up a few questions a lot of you lot were asking me about why the rules are different in different fatals now obviously there is like a great group leader and I've given them the task to decide on their rules for their fatal but the rules for this fatal will stay the same when it moves to the world tour I'll be deciding the rules and also um, the rewards and things like that so it all changes it all starts afresh and fingers crossed that we can make it a fun tournament so we take a 3-1 lead there with Suarez getting on the score sheet again but we were not done Mania linking up on through passing the ball through to Suarez and uh, I'm just going for the goals at this point even if they are terrible looking Suarez bagging it in there making making it 4-1 and seeing us take some nice profit into the second online single match of this game. So that was how it did finish, guys. The end of the game finished 4-1 to me. The likes of Walcott, Royce and also Aubameyang uh, were too much for him. He, he just couldn't break from the defence. Considering it's a still basically a silver team, I was happy with that. So let's go and have a look at game number two. So the final single match, guys, against Riziki Tribe. And we come up against a nice Brazilian, Brazilian team. And I did see before this screen that we were going to be matching up ourselves against a skill team, which was quite, quite frustrating. As you guys have seen in previous fatals, the likes of playing Chris MD and whatnot. Um... It become come a frustrating game. But there was one more thing. Not just the skills in this game. It, there was a bit of lag as well. But thankfully we took a nice 1-0 lead in 27 minutes. With Pedro putting it away. Also people have been asking why Chris MD. Um, and some of the other YouTubers aren't involved. A few of them have migrated to another Fatal series. Chris himself uh, decided he didn't want to do the series. Uh, because he had other videos to do. And that's exactly what's happened guys. So if you are seeing your favourite YouTubers missing. It's basically down to them wanting to do other videos. Which is fair enough I'm the same as well when I get asked to do some series which is very rarely that's why I do fail but you guys enjoy it and that's the main thing he managed to take a 2-1 lead knocking us down 20k so we had minus 20k in this game we had the totals together at the end Suarez breaking on through linking up with Pedro who seems to be pretty good for me and a bit of lag there did give us a bit of an advantage to uh, tramp it over to Mania to get on the score sheet in the 69th minute to give us a plus 20k in the bank but we're just even Suarez is not even 
even touched the score sheet today. Got a few assists, but he doesn't get rewarded for them. Now, in the 87th minute, the lag was bad. You can see the stutter in the gameplay, guys. Couldn't get my shot off. Quite frustrating, but somehow the ball bounced back to Suarez. Instead of shooting, I passed it all the way back, which was very, very annoying. He managed to catch his man on the counter-attack with Costa, um, and Costa is rapid. Some terrible defending there, but the lag definitely wasn't in my favour, and he does do the triple tack cross from Kelvin to Vitinho, and he does took it away in the 90th minute to take us down to minus 20k, which is frustrating. But we were gifted one more opportunity, and the lag was involved in this as well, but we did want to take advantage and get that goal. Suarez linking up with Mania again, actually Pedro I think it was linking up with Mania, and Mania just takes the run straight through his defence and smashes it into the top corner making it 3-3 in the 90th minute, so that gate with it being an online single match guys, this goes to extra time and penalties, and obviously extra time is when we try to kill the game off Suarez linking up with Mania again and a long through ball to Pedro who picks it up very very nicely, somehow manages to bundle through and smash it in to make it 4-3 in the 98th minute Nice one, but there was one more twist in this game, guys, and it was obviously going the other way, which is annoying. A long through ball through to Neymar, and Neymar just tucks it in past the goalkeeper. Also, guys, if we can try and hit over 4,000 likes in this episode, that'd be absolutely sick. Make sure if you don't fully understand the rules to go and check out the first episode, as it can all be found in there. So, penalty shootouts, and Suarez steps up, Suarez misses frustrating. I was hoping for the ball to bounce back in but it wasn't going in the right direction but there was a few more decent penalties in this shootout. So the Fatal Series guys, I will be doing a draw, I think there's three more upgrade episodes after this one, the next one coming on Saturday morning so make sure you do check that out as well and uh, also Saturday uh, Wednesday and Saturday and then we do head into a tournament against the, all the other YouTubers so penalties were going our way we sussed what he was doing after the first penalty which is just a little tap to the right and then we just stand there and get it and then we started to take the momentum even though the lag was still there a nice smash into the back of the net now penalties with lag are not good. If you've played under laggy circumstances, guys, you know they are not good. And it also happened to my opponent there who uh, did blaze it over the bar. The ball then is then put on the spot by Rakitic who then smashes it um, against the goalkeeper and actually Gil goes in. I like that type of stuff and uh, we do manage to take a lead. So at 3-1, uh, I think it's Vitinho steps up now. He scores that, which is frustrating, but then we are left to score the next penalty and hopefully take us through. And it was down to her Hernandez now, who was trying to get on the score sheet. He nebs it straight at the goalkeeper, but he went the wrong way, and we get a plus 20k just for the victory, and that's all we take from this game as it was at level terms. So, with that said, guys, we have got a nice... Um, a nice kitty to spend in this episode and that's what I wanted to get anyway uh, and we do walk away with two victories out of two which is also one positive even if it was in a scrappy manner of uh, running the penalty scenes anyway so we have 110,000 coins guys in the comment section below please write down choice one or choice two and on the screen now you are seeing the choices which I have given you uh, we have got Marcello and the, the first informed Gordine to go or is it second informed Gordine it's 86 rated Gordine anyway um, to give you a choice and the 87 Modric and Al Al Alba sorry not Alaba Alba and Modric or Marcello and Gordin right choice one for Gordin choice two for Alba and Modric so guys drop a like rate and subscribe if you're not and I'll be back later on with another video for you guys to enjoy make sure you check out all the other channels involved in the UK Fatal and if it fancies you checking out some different nationalities as well there is other Fatals going on around the world so until next time see you all later have a very very nice day